Hi, it's Whitney on Location and Unplugged. We're here at DBA talking about the upcoming show that's going to be showing at the Arts Walk this Saturday. The show is the Back in the Day show, so it's local artists showing their work from early in their career. We're going to be here talking with a well-known artist in the area. She's been showing nationally and she's homegrown right around here. Cheryl Bookout, so if you'd like to come talk to us about some of your work. Thank, thank you, Whitney. Um, yeah, I'm really happy to be here. I love the Pomona Economy. It's the only place I'd like to be. And I want to thank Sally Egan for including me in this Back in the Day show. It made me go back and take a look at some of my work that I did that I sort of wanted to forget about. <laughs> and we have one of her early pieces right here. Early this, from, what, 1970? Oh, this, this early 70s. Early 70s. Right? Early 70s, yep. So it's fun to see everybody's work and see how people have progressed. I will be having work um, coming up shortly at Bunny Gunner. Um, looking forward to that. And then again at uh, Cypress College. So I do have some projects in the works. And my new hat in town is as the administrative director for the Dawes Center for the Arts, which <laughs> thanks. Which I'm, I'm excited about. Yeah, I am too, really. I am. It's, I think it's a great collaboration. SCA Project Gallery and the Dawes Center for the Arts yeah. have um, decided to collaborate in the community to really work under one umbrella and to promote programs that we hope will benefit everyone in town and those from the greater Southern California area. So I'm very excited about it. I'm excited about it too. As some of you might know, I'm working at the DAW right now, so we'll be working with Cheryl a lot more. It should be exciting, and all throughout the summer you'll be seeing her work. Also, if you come down to DBA, you'll see some of her early work at the Back in the Day show, so come on down and see the work. <laughs> 